Good morning, folks. We've got a cosmology bombshell, news from the galactic center down to the ground, but we're starting with our star over at spaceweathernews.com. The ionized iron view of 193 angstroms tinted bronze reveals polar confined dark coronal holes and the lone bright active region crossing the disk. Trailing umbra have mostly decayed, leaving a large negative lead, and the next form of space weather expected is a speedy coronal hole solar wind stream. Northern opening releasing it is already turning out of view. Its impact is expected tonight or tomorrow morning, along with increased geomagnetic instability. We're coming next to a story about the center of the Milky Way. Astronomers are now believing there is not one, but many of those massive objects, known most commonly as black holes, and they say they get flung around rather chaotically. Up next, someone making comment about William Herschel's 1700s claim of active volcanoes erupting on the moon. Doesn't really debunk it at all, which is interesting, but not as interesting as the claim itself by such a titan of astronomy, which I did not know existed. Now keep that Herschel name in mind just one moment. There is an ESA article describing how the X-ray emission of extragalactic regions was not able to reveal the missing matter of the universe. I am using this as a springboard to remind everyone that the mass discrepancy and dynamical explanations are a function of underappreciated currents and fields in our opinion, and also of missing normal matter, not dark matter. It is both diffuse dust and ions and current hidden by that dust, so let's talk about dust. These are observations of a slew of galaxies. They were attempting to answer the dust energy balance problem. Funniest thing about all of this is they know dust has this problem. They already have evidence that the emission underplays the true dust population by a factor of three or four. And that name you were supposed to remember for a moment, Herschel. It's for whom this mission was named. And this mission is confirming that dust is way, way undercounted around galaxies in the halo and inside the visible portion. That's big for the missing matter. We end on a somber note. Torrential rainfall killed 18 in Rwanda and destroyed a number of homes via floods and landslides. Images coming in from the Rwandan government here. If you missed either of yesterday's evening updates, just click my name and find them on my channel. The best of the rapid scans and hurricanes like you've never seen them before. We've got your wind maps and shots of our star to close. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow, right here. But right now, it's 5.20 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.